this is one constant swing support where pipe is supported over the load flange this is one constant spring hanger where pipe hangs from the spring after turn buckle functionally both type of constant spring supports are same this is spring casing where the spring is kept compressed by piston plate Now we are removing the piston plate and the spring so that we can take out the bell crank lever from frame inside. Now we have taken out the entire assembly outside the frame. This is piston plate by which spring is kept compressed and inside rod is spring tension rod. This is the bell crank lever which was inside the frame. This is main pivot point which is fixed. This is movable spring pivot point and this is movable load pivot point. This load pivot is connected to the compressed spring via fixed pivot point. Shape of bell crank lever is designed in such a manner that with respect to fixed pivot point, a small movement in spring pivot point gives huge vertical movement of load pivot point when pipe comes down or moves up. Now say this is the topmost point of supported pipe. At this condition, pipe load into this distance that means load movement about main pivot is counterbalanced by equal and opposite spring moment with respect to main pivot. Now say supported pipe has come down, pipe load remains unchanged but pivot distances have been changed. At this condition also pipe load into this distance that means load moment about main pivot will be counterbalanced by equal and opposite spring moment with respect to main pivot. In this way the supported pipe gets constant effort throughout the full range of travel from topmost point to bottommost point and from bottommost point to topmost point.